All right, brand new week. Come along. Excited to be here. It is week three. <laughs> I'm on a walk and I look down and look at this rock. It's a heart. Love yourself for who you are. Thanks for tuning in to today's video. I appreciate you being here. I love sharing what I'm up to. You all inspire me so much. So here we go. All right, I'm sitting here planning my week out. Welcome to week three. I will be incorporating yoga, weights, and continuing my walks as I always do. So come along for week three. Let me show you what I've been eating and what my activity looks like. making hamburger -less helper from Well Your World. If you don't know about it, check it out. I will put this over potatoes. So good. All right, these babies are going into the air fryer. This is just my scalloped potatoes. I'll link the recipe below. Well Your World um, hamburger -less helper, but with potatoes because weight loss mode. All right, so some meal prep for the week. I made the Well Your World hamburgerless helper sauce with lentils, and then I just layered it with potatoes and baked it for 400 degrees for 20 minutes, and I did the same with just any kind of cheese sauce. Layer the potatoes, amazing. Here are my sauces for the week, hummus, ranch dressing, and a peanut sauce. I have all of my lettuce and sprouts, in here, kombucha, and a bunch of vegetables all prepped, and my casseroles will go right here. It's missing one little spot. All right, so here's my first meal of the day. I made the Well Your World hamburgerless helper, and so I just put it over a bunch of potatoes, and I have some steamed veggies. evening it's like cooler temps totally enjoying just being outside with my pups all right so this is dinner <laughs> so much veg but this is my hamburgerless helper with potatoes in it and then my full salad and steamed zucchini so this is like not as much starch but I love veg so you know you know
3.30, I had like a late breakfast, early lunch, and I'm hungry and I need to eat because <laughs> I eat when I'm hungry. So I need the Trader Joe's rice. I absolutely love it. I have like a really nice rice cooker, but there's something about this rice. It's like fluffy and I just, I really, really like it. Um, so I'll save some for another meal because I won't eat all of it because I still want to like probably have dinner tonight if I'm still hungry, which I probably will be. I'll probably eat a little bit later. So this will be later. Then I have my peanut sauce I'll add. I have veggies I'm going steaming right now, just like Trader Joe's. And then I did some sprouts the other day, so I have those. So it's gonna be a pretty amazing meal. And it literally takes seven, eight minutes. Rice takes three, veggies take four to five. This is already made. Perfect. If you don't have this steamer basket, you need to get this steamer basket. I love it. It's the best one. Best, best one. So I always take it out like that and just like let it cool a little bit so I can actually at least lift it. All right. So I just put my veggies, get all that veggie out of that steamer basket. Can't let any veg go to waste. I just love it so much. And then stir up my peanut sauce. And I usually have about like three scoops. Look at that. Mix it all together and eat. All right, I forgot to put my sprouts on the top. Well, we're just going to mix it all together. My mouth is watering. This is going to be so good. Well, we got a lot of rain. Puddles. Puddles. They love standing water. Ring around the tree. As I say, dogs will be dogs. You're so happy, Cleo! And Star Star! Beautiful evening. Dogs, be dogs. It's beautiful to see. So cool. Cleo, come. Good girl. Come on. She listens so well. All right, so I'm not crazy hungry since I had a really late lunch, so I made myself some lavash. I love it, love it, love it, love it. breakfast lunch here. Out on our evening walk. We do morning and night now and I really love that routine um, because I get to eat in the evening and then go out after I eat. 
and it gives me a little break in between my kombucha. If you're enjoying this series, I would love a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this coming your way. Here's my crew. Getting a mid-morning walk-in. The days are just flying by. I have a busy day. Um, we'll be having lunch out, so I am making a wrap. I just started following this gal, and she dehydrates wraps, and I'm so excited to try it out. So come on. Okay, so I made my wrap. Look how good this is. So I'll wrap it up. And this is what I'll have for lunch. So I basically put rice, sprouts, carrots, peppers, and lettuce into this. And the starch will be really good for filling me up. So I have this little wrap. So I'm going to wrap this up. And this is a great way to take this to go. Perfect. I might need to buy a larger wrap, wrap, wrapper. Do you see what I mean? <laughs> I might need to tape that. <laughs> okay, so I am gonna try out my wrap. I didn't eat it while I was out, so I'm gonna eat it now. So let's see what this looks like. Look how cool this looks. Okay, so I have a little free pad thai sauce because I didn't make, I didn't have a sauce with me. So. Oh my word, you all. This is so good. I'm the only one uses this one. Whoa, this is the way forward for a wrap. Simple yet so good. Okay, so I'm having another wrap. <laughs> I made three and I'm gonna have this and I'm gonna put a little bit of barbecue sauce on it and it's going to be delicious. I didn't um, add any starch in it. I'm not like super, super hungry. So I think it'll get me by. All right, it is breakfast time. I'm going for a massage today. So I'm having like a late breakfast, early lunch. Let's get going on this. All right, I'm making a one bowl everything. Hash browns, hash browns. 450 degrees for 25 minutes, toss halfway through. If you don't have this steamer basket, go buy it. I'll link it below. This is a lifesaver. So I have the Trader Joe's like raw veggie mix. I put it in here and it's four minutes. And like I'm telling you, it was a lot, but it shrinks down. This was four cups, but because it's cooked, it, it shrinks down a lot. It's delicious. Super easy meal. Best part, make a ranch dressing, anyone that you like, and put it on top of here. You'll thank me later. Mm. 
making a mess over here, but that's okay. Two spoonfuls. Mix it all up. Oh, this is so, this is such a good combo. I could have probably even used less than two. But that, the bag of hash browns is 16 ounces and then I used a full bag of Trader Joe's. So it's literally two bags of food, but it cooks down like this. Okay, one of the best parts about this meal is I literally just threw the parchment paper away. I rinsed out my steamer basket because we don't cook with oil or anything. And I already had a sauce made. Best breakfast. I can look at that. Yum. All right, so I went to town today. So I only had like um, the breakfast lunch sort of thing. And now it's dinner time. So I am getting out my hamburgerless helper. I make it with potatoes, not pasta. Because I love potatoes so much. And then I made a big salad here that I'll put in my bowl. So. Mm, so good. I say this a lot in my videos, but it's such a privilege to be able to cook my meals, eat good. It's amazing. Amazing. Okay, and I also sprinkled some nutritional yeast on top of this. I put a little bit of ranch dressing on it, my two tablespoons usually does the trick and I like to mix it in a different bowl so that it can get like all coated and then I can pour it into my my 50-50 bowl here beautiful dish you can tell I'm loading up on veggies because I have to eat a lot of salad in order to actually fill myself up if I don't do steamed vegetables they find stuff on our walks All right, it rained last night, so it's a little bit wet, cooler morning. <laughs> we will definitely take that. Okay, so I have people working at the house, and so I'm having my wrap with a bunch of veggies. And I keep getting asked, um, are these wraps like weight loss friendly? And it's just not calorie dense because it's dehydrated. So if you're looking to break plateau, lose weight, you want to have really, really moist food that has a lot of water content. Evening walk. I think storms are headed our way. Look at those skies. Can't forget our little friend Star Star. Star Star, I feel like, literally woke up last week. <laughs> I did. And she got like half the size. She's a big girl. She's growing. And I just love her energy. I love everything about her. Cleo! Good Cleo! Alright, who says hash browns have to be morning? You can eat them any time of the day. So I'm actually having like a breakfast when it's not actually breakfast. But I'm okay with that. And I steamed some zucchini. Man, I should have steamed a lot more. I can eat a lot of zucchini. This was, this was a full bag, but it's been a light bag for sure. I like a big, big bag. Today has been 
a really productive day. So winding down with some hash browns and cabbage. I'm gonna probably have to have some more veg here, but I'll start with this. If you know, you know, this is one of my favorite meals of all time. Just having some steamed vegetables, any kind of steamed vegetables, and my hash browns. All right, another standard meal that I'm having. All right, so I had my ranch dressing, I'm almost out. Um, and then I made a salad. I'm literally almost out of veggies. Like I'm gonna have to move to frozen, um, but I probably will go to the store um, in the next day or so. So I mixed it in here. I have my last batch of hamburgerless helper with my potatoes. So that's ready to go. Pour my salad into here. Oh, this is so good. And I make this ranch dressing, but I make it with white beans, so it's super low fat. So there we go for that. And I like to eat my salads with a spoon if I can. So here's the hamburgerless helper. It's so good with potatoes. You can have it with pasta, no problem. But since I really like, I just love eating potatoes, I'm really trying to incorporate as much potatoes. And the reason I'm showing you like this whole series is because you you gotta see that I, I it's repetition. I, I eat the same things, but I do that because I don't like to like be in the kitchen anymore. My old YouTube videos, I would like show you guys like new things that I would make all the time. Not so much anymore. I just, I love eating this way. It satisfies me in so many ways, like from a flavor profile to not having to make a lot of food during the week. Simple, reach, it helps me reach my goals. So many reasons why I eat this way. All right, week three came and now it's gone and it's been a really successful week. I started incorporating more yoga, more weights. I feel like I have some really good momentum going into week four. So stay tuned for more of this series because I love sharing with you what I'm eating, what I'm up to, what my activity level is, because you can do this alongside of me. And I hope that these videos encourage you to do just that. Join me in building better habits and routines. It feels so, so good. I appreciate you being here. Make sure to like this video and make sure to watch the whole series and make sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this coming your way. I'm getting some momentum, so watch out. Until next time.